So Autism in Love is a feature-length documentary that explores how adults on the autism spectrum find and manage romantic relationships. Well, the project was originally conceived by my executive producer, Dr. Ira Heilville, who is a psychologist and has worked in the autism space for 30 plus years, uh, was getting ready to write a book about the topic and uh, commissioned his then executive assistant, my now producing partner, Carolina Gropa, to conduct some research, sort of figure out what was out there about that topic. They looked into it and found that there was very little about it and thought, well, maybe this would be best explored through the lens of a documentary camera. That's when I got brought into the fold. It was about four years ago now, and uh, you know, we spent about a year in production um, and have been traveling the world with the film, sharing it with uh, those who are neurotypical and on the autism spectrum. What is next for the film? That's a great question. So in about four weeks, we're going to be available for digital download on iTunes, Google Play, Xbox, all the digital retailers. On January 11th, we're going to premiere in the United States on PBS. Uh, so January 11th, 10 p.m., we'll be broadcast in every home in the U.S., uh, two weeks after that will be available on Netflix. So by February, everybody in the U.S. somehow will be able to see the movie. I, I, what I hope it means to audiences is an opportunity to reflect on what it means to be romantically connected to not only somebody else, but to, to love yourself and allow yourself the acceptance one needs to find a romantic connection in the world. Uh, I, also think, I, I also hope that it further clarifies and humanizes autism. I think that for a long time it's been a label that has been very nebulous and scary to a lot of people. And my hope is that when people watch the movie they get a deeper insight into what it is and, and that it becomes more human and, uh, and they can see those who are on the spectrum as more accessible and relatable. This is my first film. So I didn't know much about the festival circuit. I hadn't heard of uh, NIF before. I'm from St. Pete, so this feels kind of like a hometown experience for me in a lot of ways. It's been a fantastic festival. I mean. Filmmakers like me, we love coming to places where we can feel like we're, we're ex sharing the audience's experience with them, able to do Q&As, have a continued dialogue with them, but also feel welcomed as filmmakers to a new part of the world. So Naples International Film Festival has been fantastic with that. The hospitality is unparalleled in my experience so far.